Ford making a big but a big bet on uh, EV trucks there. All right, let's move on to some culture now. And from Michelangelo to Rodin, uh, marble has been a popular medium for artists and sculptors throughout history. It's been used to carve out works of art that hold great cultural value. But as times change, special robots are now being designed to produce new works of art. Take a look. Anyone who appreciates the art of sculpting has probably heard of Carrara marble, the prized medium of some of the most popular sculptures and art pieces. It was the medium used to carve out Michelangelo's David. But as time progresses, so does technology. And now, precision robots are using the same marble to make modern sculptures. After years spent on developing a software to create a robotic arm that can carve out precise and intricate sculptures, the Bot1 was created. A robot that comes equipped with precise tools, giant arms and water jets to cool off the stone. A robot is seen as being a modern machine, and everything modern instills fear. Artisans who have not yet embraced this technology are wary, with the fear that their jobs or work will be stolen. But after an initial approach, they understand the potential, begin to use it and their life changes. Because they can work more, they can work better. In the end, technology allows you to watch a sunset while a machine works for you. It is not only a robot which steals jobs, also because a robot needs to be maneuvered every day. It needs staff to assist it. It doesn't do everything by itself. It is a non-thinking machine. It needs human instructions and the work is thus produced. Created by Robotor, a company owned by Giacomo Masari, the Bot1 enables making sculptures from not just marble but also wood and plastic. What would traditionally take years to make can now be achieved in just a couple of days and in a safer environment. But what do the traditionalists think about this invention? Well, they're not happy. A sculpture refined by a robot is a dead sculpture. That refined by an artisan, as far as I'm concerned, is a live sculpture, a fresh sculpture, a real sculpture. For me, a sculpture cannot be made by a robot because it has to be done by hand. It is something which has to be done together by the artisan and the artist. There has to be this symbiosis, the artist who puts in the art and inspiration and the marble artisan who produces with his hands the work which the artist has entrusted him to make. While the creators of Bot1 say that the robot still requires monitoring and further software development, creating more jobs in the process, Traditional sculptors are wary. There are concerns. They have questions. And so do we. What would Michelangelo say? Bureau Report Vion, World is One.